Welcome to Pink Cake Princess. I'm Andrea and today I've got a special treat for you guys. I'm doing my April Fool's prank food. This is my dessert breakfast. You can see how I make my mock bacon, egg and sausage. You can see more April Fool's prank foods with this collaboration. Check out Sugar Coder's popcorn cupcake, Haniella's asparagus dessert and Montreal Confections moldy chocolate chip cookies. You can click the links at the end of the video or in the video description below. Okay, you'll need some type of butter, margarine or some type of spread. You'll also need a banana, some maple syrup or something similar, a little bit of brown sugar, a little bit of strawberry jam, a packet of pancake shake mix, a tub of thick and creamy yogurt, some apricot halves in a can and some chocolate dairy dessert. Okay, in a fry pan with a spoon, I'm just going to add a little bit of my butter or margarine. And I'm also going to add a little bit of the maple syrup or something similar before I add in my banana. I'm just going to brown that on the pan and I'm going to add a little bit of the brown sugar just to help it caramelise up. Once it's brown, I'm going to take it off the heat and then I'm going to move on to my pancake shake mix. I'm mixing it up according to the instructions, just adding the water up to the line and then shaking it up for a couple of minutes. Now I want this actually thinner than what I normally would use, so I'm adding a little bit of extra water, probably about 100 extra mils, and then just shaking it up again. Then I'm going to pour it into two bottles. Now these bottles have icing nozzles on them, but you can use regular squirty sauce bottles. Next I'm adding a touch of red food dye into one of the bottles before I add on the lids. Now I'm going to cook the pancake on low heat. I've put a little bit of the spread into the pan and I've wiped the majority of it away. Now I'm using my bottles, I'm just going to squirt on some of the lighter coloured pancake and then squirt on some of the reddish pancake mix to form what looks like the bacon strips. Just alternating between the colours. It doesn't have to be exact, it just has to look roughly like what bacon strips would look like. Now once it's fairly cooked, I'm just going to spread a little bit of the strawberry jam on top and then I'm going to turn it over just to give it a slight glaze so that it does look like greasy bacon. I'm going to flip it over and do the same to the other side. And that's part of your bacon strip. If you are enjoying this tutorial, don't forget to click the like button below and subscribe if you want to see more sweet treats on my channel. Now I'm forming just this, the top part of the bacon. Again, repeating with the jam and just browning it, making sure that it's cooked before I remove it from the heat. Perfect pancake bacon. Now just plating it up just placing the pancake the way bacon would sit on a plate and now I've used a little bit of the yogurt and I'm just spreading it onto the plate to look like the egg whites before I place my little apricot half in the middle to form the egg yolk. Okay now I've moved on to my coffee which is basically a dairy chocolate custard dessert I've just poured it into the cup and just leveled it so that it looks like some coffee in a cup. And that's it, that's my April Fool's dessert breakfast. Serve this up and your kids won't know what they're eating, dessert or breakfast. Which was your favourite part of this dessert breakfast? Don't forget to also check out these other great prank foods. Click on the individual links or the playlist to see them here on the screen or in the video description below. 
If you do like sweets, don't forget to click subscribe up on the right there and also click the screen to see more from my channel. And thanks for watching.